Here comes the field for tonight's 10th and final race. Super effective feature. Number one is Adam Penny, owned by Warren Holland, driven by Mike Wilder. Two is Pleasing Kip, owned by Dally Hessler. The arrangement is David Miller. Here comes number three, Smokin' Samadhi, owned by Kelly Young and Rainsman Charlie Smith, Jr. Four is Mac Ryan, owned by John Cantrell and David Cantrell, Sr., with a driver change to David Hawk. Five is the last goodbye, leased by Pamela Dean. Dallas Miller is in the bike. Six, Rambling Wick, owned by Thomas and William Watson with Jeff Fout. Seven, One Step at a Time, owned by Connie Peterman, driven by Darren Mauser. Eight, Rick and Dick, owned by Rhonda Stidham and Linda May with Rocky Stidham. Nine, a Superior Society, owned by Lisa Fuller, driver change to Frenchie Fuller. Ten, Around Town, owned by Bob Perry, Joe Essig Jr. will be in the sulky. That is a field for tonight's tenth race. Dave Hawk drives the four. Frenchie Fuller drives the nine. Post time in six minutes. Field is now in motion. And there they go. They're off and pacing. Smoking somebody between horses takes the lead. Add a penny is along the rail, followed by pleasing Kip in the center. Rushing up on the far outside, the last goodbye. They're on their way to the quarter mile pole. One step at a time, followed by Rick and Dick as they make their way to the first turn. Out winging early on at Smoking Samadhi by about three. Add a penny skims the pile on second. R out of the second tier, here comes around town as they move by the opening quarter in a sharp 28 and 1. Final race pacers come past the stands. Smoking Samadhi is there a length and a half. Add a penny is in the second, followed by pleasing Kip in third. Long mile for the last goodbye. After that, it's one step at a time. Around town starts the second division from six back. After that, it's McRyan who is next. Fettled by Rick and Dick up on the outside. Rambling Wick in the trailer is Superior Society. That's a field of 10. They're at the half and 57. Straightening out for their long track down the back stretch. Smoking Samadhi, three parts of a length. Add a penny comes to the outside. Pleasing Kip with the blue perfect journey from third. Under the whip, one step at a time is fourth. Driving up on the far outside around town. Here comes Mac Ryan along the rail. Far outside, Rambling Wick, and he's got some kick. After that, the last goodbye. Along the rail, Superior Society, as they hit three quarters. Under the whip by length and a half, it's at a penny. Pleasing Kip is in the center. Rambling Wick on the far outside by three quarters in 128. This one is wide open at the head of the stretch. Pleasing Kip with a short-lived lead. Rambling Wick is right alongside. Here comes around town, around the far outside. In between horses, Pleasing Kip, Rambling Wick. Better take a long look at Mac Ryan. He is cocked, locked, and ready to rock, and nowhere to go. And here's Around Town on the far outside. It's Around Town, Rambling Wick, Mac Ryan, and here's Superior Society fourth. Result of tonight's 10th race is now official in the mile was two minutes, and here's the winner, number 10, around town. 10-year-old Bay, son of Big Tanner out of lovely Violet. Owned in Franklin, Ohio by Bob Perry. Trained by David Perry, given a well-judged drive by Joe Essig, Jr. Covering the mile in two minutes flat, number 10, around town, the winner. Three out of three in the pick three. Winning numbers 4, 5, and 10, 117 even. There's an all in the Superfectum. 